live in the dungeon. This is the Dream Warrior Review. I'm Kurt Thomas. I'm Mick Strawn. I saw Leprechaun under protest. I can understand that. Well, I watched the. I, okay, I tried to watch Leprechaun the first time. Right. And I got really I, sleepy. I, this is a theme with me lately. But I got. I was like, yeah. I, I can't hang with this. So I watched the first 30 minutes and I, I bailed. And then the next day I watched the whole thing. Right. And but you do that a lot. I was kind of like, eh. I, I don't know. I found it kind of boring. And I, I kind of liked it when it first came out. But it was because it was corny at the time. And evil. Sadistic Leprechaun goes on a killing rampage, rampage. in search of his beloved, beloved pot of gold. The only thing yes. I have to say about this, is especially great. compared to a recent film that we did, uh, that we watched, <laughs> which one <laughs> um, was at least something happened in this. Oh yeah, you're talking about that. Uh, oh yeah. By the way, welcome to the special bonus episode. Oh, that's of, right. Oh, what of the uh, Dream Warrior Review. Dream Warrior. This is, warriors. This is it. Yeah. Don't want to dream. How do you no make it sound? Uh, lepre- How do you make it sound Irish? I are, are the themes the dream are how would you make this in Irish? Let me see. <laughs> <laughs> the dream warrior. <laughs> dream warrior. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I can be. I thought without Warwick Davis, am I saying his name right? Warwick Davis, yeah. Yeah. I think without him, this would really blow. Like really suck. <laughs> yeah, it would, because he, you know, he brought some character to it. And, no, he was. I, a, I thought he was fantastic as the leprechaun. Yeah. Actually, oh no, no, absolutely. And, uh, the, I thought the whole cast was decent, but they had nothing to work with. It was yeah, like, yeah. There was, was there was no there. story here. No, Th- there was no story here. And it was like and, a and train just way, falling down a hill. It was kind of like <laughs> just picking up speed, and then it just crashed. Yeah, I have a question for you. Were we talking about leprechauns and what's the thing with the shoes? Because oh, yeah. they're leprechauns, not elves, right? right. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I thought an elf was the the ones that helped the shoes, right? I thought so. I, I mean, I didn't, so. I didn't understand why he, uh, why he had to polish shoes. You know, he's he's not he's not an elf. I don't. Um, I didn't really analyze this that much. Yeah, really. really? Oh, yeah. You didn't get into that. Well, I, I will say Jennifer Aniston. This is like, a, isn't this like her uh, only like debut second film? This only film. It, well, I thought it was like her only one before she was on Friends, or maybe it was her last one. I guess. Before, I don't know. Yeah, and um, kind of boring. You yeah. know. I mean, she. She looked she, cute though. Well, she, that, no, she was, she was cute. cute There's no time. that that she. No, no doubt she was cute. Uh, you, you know what? There was. I also wanted to throw this in um, that uh, the costumes were terrible, it, and a painter doesn't does not wear like a. Uh, I love that. A, outfit, a, like though. a hundred dollar, a hundred dollar print shirt with little paint. Cutesy but how awesome was that paint. shirt? I know it was. I, I'm <laughs> the not red kidding. shirt with the paintbrushes. I, I know. I wanted to reach in and grab that shirt, especially I didn't want him to get any paint on it, and he didn't get any paint on it. I might add. It looks like it was her only movie. Oh, before that it was just Except TV. For the TV movie. Uh, yeah, her only movie before she was wow on Friends. But anyway, yeah, I agree yeah. with you that that well they didn't have a budget obviously. Well, you see, <laughs> and, and, but 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 they also didn't know what they were doing because they dressed people in red. Yeah. And, and did you notice how they were flaring all over? I mean, the thing is, especially with the technology at the time and what the films was pretty uh, bright. did, the, the red lacked detail, so there was a red blob would come out here and talk to that red, another red blob. And, um, well, he spilled blue paint on him. That kind of helped the situation a little yeah, bit. Yeah, it did. Yeah, and, and, and incredibly bright colors that, that just... It looked I, I was actually I was looking at her outfit like I was I was remembering those LA gear shoes that were big at the time in the early 90s right. and right. just the the dorky the shorts she was wearing yeah but it, yeah, it was the whole thing was interesting the yeah Daisy wardrobe Boots. wise was definitely an interesting movie um what did you think of the makeup though the on, on Warwick I thought it was pretty awesome yeah, it even was though all right. I, I did have problems because it seemed it, like it was very dark for a while like I couldn't see yeah it. yeah for the longest time they you couldn't they, see him at all but but. But you know, obviously it, it was intentional. Yeah, and and obviously like, like this was a spoof. That the feel for it, I, I mean, it was a spoof it wasn't on a movie. Scary, no, the, the the feel for it was kind of re- reminiscent of Tremors. Yeah. Oh, it, Tremors. You yeah. know, it but, kind of like had that uh, that n- not too much taking itself seriously. 
But uh, Tremors effect. was actually a good movie. Well, I, <laughs> so I understand that. I, was like, I, I do. I, I actually, yeah, basically my first thing I wrote down was cheap, low budget, f- funny, bad. Not scary. <laughs> Not scary. Yeah, uh, humors. Yeah. Right, humors. Um, they, they tried to do some humor, and I, I don't know. Yeah, it wasn't very good. It, 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 um, yeah. Yeah, the, it, it didn't have uh, Kevin Bacon in it. Uh, it didn't have. Um, right, it didn't have Kevin Bacon. I like. I did like the. I mean, it was really funny to watch him run away. Like, try and catch me. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. No. That was, yeah. 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 Boy. Oh, and by the way, you talk about beautiful. I mean, Jennifer Aniston was kind of cute, but the yeah. woman that was tied up at the very beginning. Oh yeah. She was gorgeous. I mean, she was absolutely beautiful. She probably couldn't um, do dialogue worth a stick. Um, <laughs> you know, so therefore they just, you know, uh, yeah, just looked at her a little bit because when she w- <laughs> came up, Daddy! It was like, Daddy! <laughs> it was a little bit overblown. Um, oh, yeah. But, um, yeah. But yeah, bit, the, uh, the shoe fetish and the awful design. I I did think it was very boring. I have yeah, to say. actually, I was pretty bored. Then I, I I actually I felt the need to fast forward, which I never do. Yeah, I always do. I was. Uh, <laughs> I always watch things that yeah. Uh, yeah in, the plot in general, and the, the in dialogue a, was boring. Like in general, I watch everything at about one point eight speed. And that's 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 up a, a, around my attention level. Doesn't that ruin it for like when you go to like what we when we saw that movie last what Friday? Yeah, we went to see uh, Captain Marvel. No, Captive States. Right, right. You probably wanted to fast forward so badly. Oh maybe. my god, I could have, I could have, <laughs> I could have watched that film in about ten minutes. <laughs> <laughs> no, you you know what I do is it, 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 it's funny things that you find out at, uh, as as I've been watching films faster and faster and faster is that you get really used to it um, and you can start to understand dialogue really really fast. <laughs> it's like it used to be if I put it at one point five, I didn't understand what anybody was saying, but now I can get up to like um, one point nine and two uh. times as much, and, and and I can understand. I've it. done that on the podcast. Podbean app that we happen to be on. Oh, Podbean that people yes, can follow I do that all us on. The time too. Uh, I do that sometimes, especially when I'm listening to like my newscasts that I listen to all the time. Yeah, right. And I'm used yeah. to the reporters' kind of way of talking. I can fast forward it and catch, catch everything. Right, I say. right. You know, one, 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 but but you kind of got to know that person. Yes. You know, it's it, it's like you, you can't do it with somebody new because the inflections of their voice you 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 don't get. It sort of feels like a different language. You know. And I don't want to put myself in a box, but I listen. to all the time yeah i'll bleep that out but, no, you know, so, but no you won't but she has a certain way of talking and it's very clear right she could be sped up a lot right yeah. right but, oh yeah oh yeah anyway. um so there were seven i think there were seven leprechaun movies and i made the mistake of buying one that said oh these, these are all widescreen and it's one through four it's, it goes all the way through leprechaun oh, four yeah. in space yeah oh, it was a terrible <clears throat> version and it was a full screen and it was awful. And it's better than my other version that I had that I bought on eBay years ago, and it ended up being a bootleg, Leprechaun. And really oh, bad copy. Okay. Yeah, this yeah. is even worse. Yeah, no, but well, it wasn't as bad as it could be. The I other mean, one was a copy I mean, from I've a had, VHS. I yeah, onto Ugh. a DVD. You know, yeah, <laughs> yeah. No, I was just about. Oh, by the way, uh, I wanted to mention something. Uh, if you if you want a clue as to how farcical this film got um <laughs> there was a death by pogo stick yes in here yes now i had to say that at first i thought to myself wow death by pogo stick now that's pretty low and you well, know it was what more creative than the first death. it is creative the first death was kind of just like oh, i'm gonna push it down the stairs okay. yeah right yeah 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 yeah, yeah. Uh, I, I agree but the pogo stick was better and by the way um don't you know that only in a film can you push somebody down the stairs and they're dead every time, right? <laughs> <laughs> I, I really don't think that that happens. And those stairs know? are only four, probably yeah, four yeah, feet. Yeah, right. Yeah, probably. Feet, maybe. <laughs> well, I, I was confused by his magic, like how he used his magic, because he was inside a box with a four-leaf clover on top of it where he could supposedly couldn't yeah, you get could, out could, because of the four-leaf yeah, clover. I know, how can I he did. do magic through that? Well, I you know I what confused. I did love I did love though the thing at the end where they take it where he rolled it up 
and shot it. And I thought into his mouth. Oh, that was, yeah, ah. that was brilliant. That was that was actually the slingshot. <laughs> That was kind of brilliant. That was to me. That it was, was actually cool the best cool thing. And it had a little optical effect on yeah, it. Yeah, a little. Yeah, it, <laughs> it l- started little, glowing. Little, little three second optical <laughs> to go with it. Yeah, that was kind of a treat. Did it feel kind of like exploitative a little bit at times, like exploiting little yeah. people a little bit too much? Oh, totally. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> it's kind of uncomfortable a little bit. But uh, I'm not going to say I was uncomfortable. But the makeup it. made made up for it. I started by looking at the second one. Yeah, and the oh, makeup yeah. the makeup on the second one was terrible. It looked it looked more like they just. I haven't even seen the second one. I, I just happened to well, have it. Well, it, it's funny because the second one it it kind of looks like they just modified a, a mask of a raccoon. <laughs> It's pretty bad because the stripes are still there. Even you know, it's it's like ugh. it's kind of like the, how Ginger Dead Man it, evolved. Exactly, <laughs> it got worse. Exactly. <laughs> oh, speaking of Ginger Dead Man, I I think see the, okay. I usually like stuff like this. It's like kind of weird humor and like stupid. Yeah, but Ginger Dead Man is is similar, but it's different because I think it had strokes of brilliance in there. Like with oh the, yeah, no, especially no, no, with Absolutely. the writing, the writing, the writing on William all Butler the, pulled all yeah, that through. The, yeah, the, the the writing and the thing is, is you know, you've talked to William Butler yeah. with me before. William is just a snarky guy. Yeah, you know, I mean, and it comes across through he, Ginger Dead Man. Yeah, which he's I kind of wish really somebody funny. like him wrote for this one. Right, exactly, because these jokes were really, really flat. Yeah. You know? It was um, if it was a little bit more s- sarcastic, maybe or well, know. you know, and, and I imagine to myself is that character Warwick Davis, yeah, his character being really funny, snarky would be awesome. that would be awesome. Yeah, well, he's done it. He's had a really good career. I well, mean, he has. I mean, he's done a lot of. I mean, Doctor Who and like uh, well, yeah, Doctor Who forever, right? Oh, see, there's Leprechaun Four in space. I don't know if he did anything beyond Four, but I mean, he's done Star Wars movies. I mean, oh yeah. What was the most oh, recent it, stuff? It, 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 he used to live in uh, Canyon Country, up where we did, yeah. and um, he owned um, the very first. It, 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 and I distinctly remember this: is he owned the very first video store in in Canyon Country, and that uh, he <laughs> the very first video store. Well, yeah, well, what year you was know, that? In the eighties, or yeah, it was in the eighties sometime. Um, maybe. Well, this movie was ninety three. Was it around the same time, or was it before that? No, no, no. It was way before that. No, oh, okay. no. It, it was. Uh, it was. I'm trying to think that he might have been working in Troll. Mm. He did some. Mm-hmm. He, I think he did some stuff in. Is that right? Uh, oh, Labyrinth was that or Willow? I don't know Troll. No, actually, I'm not thinking. You know what? It might not be Warwick. It might be. Uh, because I think that he actually lived in Britain. Troll. Who, who was the troll? Tr- Torok the troll. Phil? Is that right? Phil Fondacaro. This is the guy. Story time. Story time. With it's story time with Mick. 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 It's funny because they're similar characters, troll and they, leprechaun. They, 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 in a way. they, they are, <laughs> and, and so, uh, yeah, they, it, it was uh, really funny because he had his, own, he had the, uh, uh, this video store, and I remember because I was one of the first ones to get an account there. I mean, when you had to like get the account and all that, yeah. you know, and yeah, had to get checked out. It took like an and hour. I, and it, yeah, and I think I think that he probably had maybe a hundred cassettes or uh tapes in there <laughs> all together <laughs> and um eventually became a really you know uh but but he had the uh, most wonderful um way of uh he'd go up a ramp like like you would you would both be heading towards you know the uh the the cashier right and and, and he would say, "Oh, let me find that for you." And, and you go, and he come, he come around, and and you know he would be a little tiny, and then, uh, and then you would walk, and he would walk behind the counter, and you'd walk in front of it, and as you were going along, and he'd be raising 
as he went you know, <laughs> right. until you were both eye to eye. And I was like, oh, yeah, okay, there you go. <laughs> a little ramp built in. Yeah, it, it was... Um, well, there's one, what is it called, you know, six degrees to Kevin Bacon? Well, there's one degree to, to, to Warwick Davis. He was in Willow with him. Oh, well, there you go. Between the two, huh? Yeah. yeah. So it fits. Totally fits the story go. here. There you go. But no, that's so, pretty funny. And yeah. So it, I think he told me about him because I, I remember you saying something about uh, that his money from that one of his movies paid right. for the well, video store or paid something. Paid for the video store, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah. But he's not actually, I mean, he's, he's been evil an evil bong. bong. Evil bong. <laughs> he's had an interesting career. I don't think it's yeah. his, uh, what, what's the word? It's uh, not his... Uh, extensive as warwick's yeah career, but. yeah well yeah um which one of them was on the uh was on um oh uh 30 rock or is that somebody else <laughs> might be somebody else yeah because they all look alike right <laughs> no. wow oh man yeah uh, no i did that I, I that's where i went no 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 so anyway well but um yeah, so, um, yeah, did I already go into a long, uh, involved uh, story for Not this? Not really, no. No? That was a good story, though, about Warwick Davis that ended up being a story about Phil exactly. Fondacario. Exactly, because, um, you know, I'm species. <laughs> <laughs> People said that production designers all look alike. Yeah, well, we do. <laughs> <laughs> Even the female ones, yeah. Even the female ones, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we all need to shave. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Boy, you got to get me out of this. <laughs> I know. Well, no, I don't think we're being disrespectful. I mean, it's like they were both in. No, I was being disrespectful. Yeah. I was. I, I wasn't trying to be. I, I, I was. I'm sorry. I, I, I just have to say. You know. Well, we are talking about Leprechaun, which mm. I think is, you know. That's right. How, what was your rate to re- Leprechaun? Are we already there? I think oh, we're already there. You know what? This is and a short here's and a weird thing. episode. Here, here's, here's a weird thing. Is, um, normally I don't um, I don't uh, rate things uh, as low as the last two films. <laughs> I mean, low. I mean, really low. Because uh, this one, I, if I gave it a 1.1, I'm being really generous. See, I think I would agree, but I'd give a couple points to his performance. Yeah. Because obviously they brought him back for three more. So Well, obviously. At least. I don't know if he did six or, or five through seven, but. Hey, if the mask fits, wear it. I give it a 1.5. <laughs> He's okay. the Freddy Krueger. Okay, the Freddy Krueger of little people. Well, there, there we go. go. There you go. And, um,. And obviously yeah. he's a good actor. It, yeah. Because yeah. he's been um, in a lot of other stuff. That's... You know what? I'm going to take this time just, just to throw out there that uh, uh, I I actually finished my stage play oh. and, and got that set up. That set finished. Beautiful. Um, I got my uh, my location set up for um, Vengeance. Vengeance. And um, I'm going to be tomorrow. you have to say tomorrow. it like that with that weird face? I did. I did. That was really scary. So uh, uh, I'm, I'm going to be out there, and we're going to start filming this weekend. Yeah. Although, with all the messed up flights and the polar vortex, too, um, hopefully we'll have somebody to film. <sighs> Hard to tell, isn't it? Yeah. It's not like a TV where you can just spend the day shooting B-roll or something. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> We all dressed up, nowhere to go. Shoot some stuff for the credits. I don't know. Yeah, exactly. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Yeah. Yeah. Um, so anyway, that's um, that's what I'm doing. Oh, I got a podcast. Did I mention? Oh yeah, yeah. So you've been yeah. bouncing around everywhere. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And somehow you found time to watch these horrible movies. Yes, I've been I, recommending. I. I, I... <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, I think we're gonna do. Uh, we're gonna do a little block. proxy. I think. Yeah, Hud sucker. Which block. actually was supposed to be for daylight saving. So right. I intentionally but, didn't turn my clocks until we did the review on HUD Sucker Proxy. Because okay. there's a well, clock in HUD Sucker Proxy. You're running a little bit late. That's then. really the only connection to Daylight Savings is there's a clock in it. There you go. <laughs> Thanks for joining us on the Dream Warrior Review Podcast. Don't forget to tell your friends about us, follow us, and of course, like us. We can be found on Podbean, which is an amazing app, YouTube, Stitcher, Alexa, on any pod, 
iTunes, Google Play. We're on Twitter as well, at DW Review. And, of course, Facebook. You can find us there. You can also email us at dreamwarriorreview at gmail.com. <laughs>